Okay, I'm gonna make a deal with you guys. If we can get 2,000 likes on this video, I will take this rock scooter deck, we'll put it on a scooter, and we'll try and ride it. Also, I have some really big news at the end of this video, so stay tuned. Hey, what's poppin' everyone? Welcome back to a brand new video. So today, I have a stupid idea, but also like really freaking cool. So if you guys know, my wrist is broken. It's been broken for a couple weeks now. Obviously, I'm still making YouTube videos because also the schedule has changed. If you saw my story on Instagram, um, pretty much I just explained that I'm only gonna post Monday and Friday at four instead of Monday, Wednesday and Friday. Obviously, when I get back, I can go back to that normal schedule, but for now, Monday and Friday at four, that's how it's gonna go. And it's either that or disappearing off the face of the earth and not filming at all, so I chose that. Obviously. So today's idea, like I said, it's pretty stupid. It's like one of the dumbest things I've ever thought of. So today, little man and I are here, and we're pretty much going to go to Home Depot, and uh, we're going to get a bag of concrete and absolutely cover and literally make an entire deck out of concrete. So we're going to get one of my old scooter decks and literally, I mean so literally, either cover it and just absolutely, it's going to be completely smurred. You won't be able to see the actual deck, or hopefully, and we're going to try and just... Put it together and see if it works. Little man is also here. We're filming this for his channel, so if you guys want to see his video, it'll probably come out after this one. So we gotta go to Home Depot and grab the cement and also grab a bucket if we need one. I don't even know if we need one now. Oh, look at me struggling to open the door. Ah, yeah, we did it. Ah, let's go. Opening stuff. Made it. Oh. Ruining the vlog. Okay, we don't really know what we're doing. Never made concrete myself. Never bought concrete myself. So I'll we could literally end near, up, dude, like, imagine we just end up like our entire bodies are just rocks by the end of this yeah. video. Boo, the boy. There's a living cat in the store. His, his sister Pepper. Bro, 2021 is wild. Hello. That's you too. Oh my god. Oh, that's, yeah. that's sick. I thought it was a prop at first, but then it like blinked. I was like, oh, for it. <laughs> what the funny? Got all the materials. Now, the only problem is we don't really know how to make concrete, like I said. We're just gonna <laughs> eyeball it, I guess. Sounds good enough to me. All right, well, we gotta buy this. Next thing you know, it's like $500. Right. <laughs> Chillin', that was only like $9. <laughs> ah, my arm barely even worked. Made it back to the house. What we're gonna do is we're gonna take the bucket that I'm holding right now, we're gonna put it all the way over there. Now we're probably gonna use like a stick to mix it because you really can't, you have to mix the concrete with the water. Um, and we're not really sure, like I said, how much water we're gonna need. We're just gonna eyeball it, I guess. You have to remember, we have to put water in it and then we have to have another bucket for our hands. All right, so we're just gonna fill this up. Barely opens the door. Oh snap, there's a big hole in that. Okay, got pretty much all the materials. Got half a bucket of water because, well, there's kind of a massive hole in this thing. That is a huge hole. Note to self, well, note to anybody, never let teenagers do anything cool because, um, well, forgot the most important part, the whole deck. He's got the deck. We're actually gonna use one of my AOS V4 decks that I had a long time ago, the white one, if you guys remember it. Um, I don't really care about it too much, so we're gonna use this, I guess. Let's cut. Oh open this and then just like pour everything out. Essentially the idea is to just make the, like completely make the concrete and then just kind of hydro dip the deck in and then we'll just cover it and take it out and hopefully it dries. Now I'm gonna just guess. Yeah. So I think, I guess, just yeah, like. Yeah, just dump it. I think you just. Just like. Okay, yeah, so. Yeah, pretty much just to the point where it gets to like a good like consistency. Tell me why this doesn't look like every river in Los Angeles. Literally every river is just brown grayness. No headset, no brake, no back axle. Hopefully we can put a wheel on this, but for now we're just gonna make the deck and cover it. This is about to be like a million pounds. So we're gonna keep doing this and we're gonna I'm gonna catch you guys when it's like a cake batter like mixture kind of texture idea because I know you guys don't want to watch people stir things for five hours. We are pretty much done. The bat, the concrete is pretty good. It's a pretty good consistency. And we're pretty, like I said, we're just gonna hydro dip the deck, but in cement, so it's gonna come out completely like a rock. Just, like, Put the deck completely in. Junk up. Okay, well, there's no turning back now. <laughs> just Pick please up. get it out before it dries, so it's not like stuck to the bin. Just has to ride a bin. Everything. All oh, the white. Oh no. I don't even know why I didn't think of that, because now this is gonna be like the ugliest color ever. Ugh. 
Look at that. Oh my god. Oh my god. This is literally. This looks horrible. Like, I hope it. Well, it's just gonna come out like a giant rock. Look at the bottom. Look at that. Oh my god. Dude, this is probably what like 99% of concrete skate parks look like before they're dried. Look at that nice scoop of that cement. <laughs> Yo. Oh my god, dude. <laughs> Yo. Oh my god. Dude, it literally looks like a giant piece of doo doo. Sound though, dude. Oh, yeah, nice. And just. <laughs> oh my god! Oh, he's going barehanded. I don't know if this is like bad. I don't know if you're like not supposed to do this. I don't know. It's smoothing oh, out though. I got salt in my eye. Watch like... Bro. Dude, this is like those one videos where those people are like building houses out of mud in like the forest. <laughs> Bruh! Look at the head tube, it's like non-existent. Oh my god. We, got, we have to clean out the inside because at some point we're gonna try and put a bar through this and like actually ride it. Oh, it worked perfectly! Somehow. Really? Did it? Perfect, dude. You can see right through it. Okay, I think that's about perfect. It's just what we wanted. Okay, so we got the deck now. This thing's like 20 pounds probably. This thing is really heavy. Hopefully that works. And I'll just with that right there. That's not bad, actually. And then what I'll do is I'll just take this little bit out. Oh god. You gotta be real careful with that. Make yeah. sure that joint does not fall. Okay. Well, now it's pretty much just gonna dry. There's nothing else we can do except for wait. So uh, let's see how this turns out in a few hours. So now what we pretty much have to do is we have to get all this non-used concrete and put it somewhere. But in the meantime, the deck came out very well actually, like better than we expected. We weren't really sure if it was gonna work at all, but it actually did. And it looks like we're gonna be able to get a headset in there, which is a big, big plus because then we can put the axle back there somehow, some way, if that even works. Cause I got all the hardware literally right there. That's the brake, and then the axles are somewhere. So there's not much else we should do, um, or at least that I know we can do. So it's pretty much just gonna dry overnight. Hopefully it doesn't rain, we'll probably cover it in a tarp or something. And then I'll uh, see you guys tomorrow and see how it turned out. It's just gonna be like a harder version of what it is right now, which is gonna be pretty cool though. Okay, it's been like two days now. Um, it's completely dry, the deck is, it's completely dry. Mainly because it's like 90 degrees out and um, obviously the heat, the light dries really fast. Okay, I just picked it up. It is fully solid, like it, it worked. Okay, you ready? Look at this. Oh my God, what the heck? It actually worked. Like here, look, listen, I'm literally just, that is rock solid. This thing legit is just like a rock. Okay, so here's the big news that I mentioned at the start of the video. So next video, which is Friday, I have some a huge announcement. I've been waiting to tell you guys this for so long, and I'm really, really stoked. So next Friday, I got a big announcement coming. So that's number one. And the second big thing, I got a drone. Here's what I mean. Check this out. Okie doke. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed those drone shots. Um, I'm actually really surprised at how good they came out. That was like the first time I actually filmed with the drone, and it turned out perfect. And yes, you did see me hit that rail over there. That was like first try. I can do it one-handed. I know because my wrist is broken, I shouldn't really be doing that, but I couldn't help myself. I wanted to try, see what I could do, you know, get comfortable, but also know that, like, you know, you can't get comfortable because I still have to take it very easy on my hand. Um, it's pretty strong now compared to what it was earlier, but also just wanted to thank you guys so much for all the support lately, the Instagram messages after I broke my wrist, obviously. Um, it means a lot to me. I didn't actually know people cared that much. So yeah, I just appreciate all the love. It really means a lot to me. As I'm filming this right now, which is a couple 
couple of days before this video is actually released, we hit 95K, which is so insane to just say, oh my goodness, that's crazy. 100K is just around the corner. It's been a dream of mine to do that. And um, it's coming close, which is great. But yeah, I think that's pretty much it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Catch you guys next time. Later.